Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20, and welcome to episode 111 of Direwolf20's Let's Play series. Hello! What do you need? It would make my job much easier if I had 16 potatoes and carrots. Okay! Uh, last episode we made ourselves a hospital, which uh, is now finished building. And I'll just let you guys know that as soon as I uh, finished building the hospital, my two sick folks in my village came over here to get a little bit of healing going on. Um, so you can see both of them, Sophia and Thomas, are here, and cool. All right. Uh, now, is there an inventory for the hospital? Yes, right here. I'll just drop some potatoes and carrots, and hopefully that will satisfy their needs. So let's see how this hospital works out. Uh, I'm assuming that Aridini Coffin, Mr. or Mrs. Coffin, can't tell, um, who I hired here to be the, you know, medic, because they had the best mana and knowledge stat in the village. Um, should hopefully be able to handle this situation. I guess we'll see. I'll get to build it again? I'll work on it. Oh, hello. Huh. It's looking like things worked out here. Huh. I guess they're being healed. That's cool. Huh. Neat. So, hey, no more manually uh, dealing with influenza. What I'll do is just grab a few more carrots and potatoes. Because those are like, you know, the magic ingredients for curing influenza. Uh, we'll just leave them in here. And then as as villagers get sick, I'm assuming that they'll get better. That's cool. Uh, it's becoming nighttime. We worked on upgrading this hut now to number two. So that's cool. Who was working on that? This guy is working on it. Uh, what do you need? Anything in particular? No, you seem to be pretty good in upgrading that 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 hut. So that's cool. Um, I should I should hire somebody over there, shouldn't I? Did I already hire somebody? I forget. I can hire somebody while it's being upgraded, right? Uh, Eric is working here. Yes, I already hired someone. Nice, nice. So that's cool. Good, 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 good. Uh, so today's episode, I want to work on that uh, sawmill because that finished researching and I started another research I feel like I think I started another research uh I forget which one because you know me I forget things but uh let's see civilian dean's office yes uh let's see one out of one research in progress I think I started on the school is that what I did higher learning yes unlocks the school no idea what that does I assume it's a place for children to go hang out but I don't know uh, I feel like I should also get another house going. Would that be cool? Or maybe upgrade our existing houses to tier 3? That might be cool. Oh, Sophia's still healing. Oh, nice! All healed up. Well, that's cool. With pleasure. Get to build it again? You do get to build it again. Isn't that exciting? So let's get, a, let's get some more housing here. Uh, so we have more more villagers because obviously as we expand we're running out of 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 workers right so we need uh you know we need we need more housing for people to do work in so let's get another one of these here of the wooden variety now i'm told that if uh if we leave it at level five it's not a big deal uh it'll be fine so we're gonna do that so i'd like this guy to kind of match why are you all flipping? That's not cool. That's not what I want to see. Oh, cool. Finished building Delivery Man 2. Well, then let's upgrade it again. I would like it to be Delivery Man 3. All right, so that's the front door, right? So we want to... Now that's the front door. So two more like that. And then we want to align it such that it's relatively well aligned to the building here, right? And that should be cool. I like that. Yep, there and there. Perfect. And then you're aligned to that guy. Nice. And do the thing. So I will go ahead and request the build to occur here. Build options, begin building. 
somebody else will get working on that because we've got the two builders now. Uh, so they'll get us more housing. I want to upgrade all four of my houses once they're done. Once once this one's done being level two, I'm going to get all four of these upgraded to level three. Uh, and then we also want the sawmill, right? Isn't that what it's called? Uh, sawmill. Yes. Perfect. Cool. And we're going to want a level three version of this, I assume. I don't know. I'm not sure entirely what it does, but we're going to find out. And I want this person to live right here-ish next to... Uh, in between the builders and, yeah, I think that seems cool. Now, if I made you a level five, I want to make sure that he's rotated such that his front door is kind of facing this direction. I'm kind of trying to get all the things, you know, facing the right way and whatnot. That seems pretty good, right? Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that looks cool. All right, begin building, and that should be good times. Sweet. So let's see if anybody has needs for things. Uh, you can use a few more torches and some more oak stuff. Red bed and torch. Okay, I can handle these requests. I absolutely can. Okay, so we'll put these guys in there. Just a little extra, because why not? Um, what else do you need? A lot of oak things. Logs, planks, pressure plates, and stairs. Not a problem. Actually, I'm going to get a bunch of these guys. And maybe we'll check out the school today, too, if we have time. So I'm going to get two stacks of you. Stack of pressure plates. Um... Quite a few of those. Oh, wow. Delivery Man 3 is already done. That's awesome. Good job, villagers. And you're now satisfied. Beautiful. All right. So Delivery Man 3 is now upgraded. Looking good. Good job, Courier Hut. All right. Um, how should we handle the next set of things? So I think at this point, we basically want to see this place be built. Right? Um, I don't think it would be a bad idea. To just flatten the terrain a little bit like that. Yeah, that looks good. Cool. And you're working on the sawmill. Nice, dude. Do you need anything for the sawmill or are you cool? Some fences, logs, and slabs. No problemo. Oak. Slabs, fences, and this is hopefully, I think, one of the last times we're going to have to deal with manually crafting oak-based items. Because I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think, uh, oh good, he just brought some oak logs over. Thanks, buddy. Do you need something, or are you, are you just grumpy about it? Yeah. No guard, I'll work on it. All right, look, there's totally a thing right here. It's a guard tower. Isn't this a guard tower? Yeah, there's a guard tower right here. I know, you want more. These villagers always wanting more, I'll tell you. I understand, they don't feel safe. I'll work on that at some point. We'll see. I could get this build going too. I should go ahead. Yeah, let's kick this off. Build building. Maybe we'll get one snuck in over here. Guard tower. I should get a I should get a barracks at some point. That would probably be cool. I want to make sure that this is placed in a way that makes sense. Placed in a way that makes some semblance of sense. What if it was there-ish? A wooden guard tower of level five. I want to make sure that it's not, you know. That looks pretty good, right? Yeah. And then there's plenty of room for building stuff, you know, over here-ish. We'll probably have to, like, terraform, obviously, a good bit, but that looks cool, right? All right, I'll let that happen. Eventually. We're going to totally need more villagers, though, before we can populate these buildings. That's the problem. That's 100% the problem. 
All right, let's see how this dude's doing. He got his resources he needs. Yeah, he's pretty happy. Cool. All right, so we should have our sawmill in a minute. We're going to hire a sawmill person and see how this building works. Because I, as you know, have no idea. We're figuring it out. Good job, Kai. It's your gold. It is my gold. I've never given any of you gold, so I don't know why you keep saying that. But I assume there's a reason. I could totally, like, I get to you build know, it again? hire some of these folks. It's your gold. Well, that guy actually wants gold to live here, so it makes sense that he's saying that now. No one else makes sense, just that guy. All right, he's torching it up, which means we're pretty much done. Cool. Just... Hooray! Sweet. Sawmill, good. All right, so first let's get a worker in here. Um, not the best worker. Knowledge and dexterity is what we need, huh? I'll take care of it. Knowledge and dexterity. How oh, very good dexterity. Pretty terrible knowledge, though. <laughs> knowledge is one. Not good enough, eh? Okay, dexterity. Pretty good knowledge. I get to build it again. Fifteen quartz. I could probably do that. I serve with pleasure. Not enough space to house another citizen. See, that's that's part of the problem. Well, we're waiting for this house to be built anyway. Um, are you waiting for resources or what's your beef? Now you're pretty good. We should be there soon. Let's upgrade this guy while we're waiting then. Shouldn't be a problem to get him upgraded to level two. I would think that that'll be quick, and then we'll figure out what's involved in, you know, doing stuffs. Here comes Eric. Cool. I wonder if there's paths you can build. Are there paths or something? That's guard tower decorations. Hmm. Fields. That's kind of cool. Infrastructure. Nether ship. Player housing. Rail. Well, that's neat. Roads. Oh, look at that. Cool. Roads. I'm just curious, like, what it looks like. Roads simple? Oh, look at that. Well, that's cool. That's neat. Simple corner even, simple corner odd. Intersection, oh, that's cool. Path even, that's kinda neat. I like that there's odd and even versions of each, of each thing. That's kinda cool. That is kind of cool that there's an odd and even version of each thing. Because, you know, some people like building odd, some people like building even. I guess what I should do is, like, build a few more buildings and then maybe some roads between them. And I wonder if, you know, the, the courier will follow the roads and if they walk faster on roads or something like that. You know what I mean? That would be kind of neat. I should think about that. What if I tried this real quick? I just want to try it. Simple path. Do we want an even path or an odd path? I don't quite know. We're going to figure it out. I serve with pleasure. Okay. So this is coming from the warehouse -y thing. Eh, see, if we want it to line up nicely here, we should make it even. That looks pretty good. That's not bad. Decoration request created. Now if I want another one... Buddy rats. I can't tell. I can't quite tell. I feel like, but I'm gonna I'm gonna cancel it. Now here's my other question, by the way. 
I do have this this question. Um, if I manually build it, will it still register as a road or not? I would assume not, right? But I don't know how the inner workings of the mod work. But I'm curious if like, you know, let's say, you know, I missed a piece and I wanted to fill it in manually with a couple pieces of gravel. Would that, would that work? Mm -hmm. Hooray, Citizen 1 is complete. Nice. All right, let's get that upgraded immediately, please. Thank you. How's my sawmill coming along, buddy? Are you missing something or what? Because I don't see you doing a lot of work. Now you got most of what you need. Well, let's go, Kai. Get to work. We'll come back in a minute once we've got a few more things taken care of here. My mistake, Kai, was working on this guard tower over here. Cool. I'll take care of it. I know you will, buddy. Oh, hey, check it out. Kai's working on the on the on the path for me. That's cool. I guess he's gonna dig the whole thing out. I could probably help him out a little bit, right? There you go. I'll let him do a little bit of his own work. Neat. Hey, we have a new child. Okay, good. That's one thing I noticed is... We almost always get children pretty quickly as soon as there's living space, so it's kind of hard to hire people from the tavern that show up because, you know, as soon as there's new living space, they're like, oh, baby was born. Good job, Melina. I serve with pleasure. She really wants a job. Look, I'm sorry. I'll get to it eventually. Maybe once the sawmill's done being upgraded over here, you can have a job. How's that sound? We'll see. Now, where's Kai? Is he doing his exercises? No, oh, he's on his way. I want to see how this uh, road turns out here. And then what I kind of want to do is judge how I would like... So I'm thinking what we want... is that, right? Yeah. Because if we do that, we're missing a line. So basically, when we place it, we want it to be... such that it's overlapping one little bit. So like that is basically how we want to place it. Pretty sure that's accurate. Pretty sure that's accurate. Guess we'll find out, but I think that's right. Yeah, see how it's kind of overlapping a little bit? We want it to be kind of overlapping a little bit. Oh good, somebody's working on Citizen 2. Good job, Kai. Proud of you. Need some oak logs? I think our courier will take care of that. Thank you for ignoring the path I made for you, buddy. Yeah, he should be bringing my oak logs in. Yup, he did. Nice. All right, should we look at hiring somebody over here? Because I need to figure out how this works. Um, I guess Melina could have this job. She has good adaptability. But her dexterity and knowledge are just oof. Let me just look at our prospective citizens, if we have any. Apparently we don't, at least not in the tavern. I serve with This is the one I kind of liked with decent agility, decent knowledge. I serve with Pleasure. Oh, I don't have the quartz anymore. Did I put it away? Not good enough, eh? Yeah, see, not enough space. Because as soon as I built a house, they're like, oh, baby. That's fine. That's fine. 
We'll get another house soon. I definitely need like better houses. I guess I could hire her for now and then fire her later and switch her job if I wanted to. Yeah, let's do that. All right, Melina, come work here. Uh, so let's see, list of recipes. There are 20 that are available. Teach recipe, oh, that's cool. Now, can I J-E-I this? Like if I wanted to say oak, Oak planks, I think they already know, right? But slabs we could teach? Sweet. Stairs? Cool. Uh, fence? We should probably do sticks, right? I hope you or dictionary these, by the way. We'll find out. Maybe I should, you know, use proper sticks. Yeah, let's remove that and that. Teach recipe, oak, fence, but we're gonna do you and you. Sweet. Um, pressure plate? Mm. We'll hold off, that's rare. So I'm guessing, why do you have this recipe in here? I don't know. I didn't teach that, did I? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see what happens. But in theory now, when they need stairs, for example, the courier will bring wood over here. Should I teach it that wood equals, like, planks? Because you have a lot of like the stripped oak wood and stuff recipes, but you don't have the planks recipe. So I should probably teach that one. So oak log. Cool. Look, they decided to add this one again. Okay. I mean, that's fine with me. They can add their own. I'm cool with that. I ain't going to object. I like it. Hey, Citizen 2 is done. Nice. And you're almost done making this little dude. So that's cool. Should we start getting these upgraded to level 3? I think we should. Build options, upgrade. We'll upgrade these two. And we'll see how that goes. Cool. Now, how's my research on a school going? It's got to be almost done, I would think. Actually, no. Quite a long time left. Quite a long time left, but that's okay. I think at this point, we'll hold off. Let me just see. You guys are, are working on your roads and whatnot, right? And so you finished Simple Path. You started on a new Simple Path. Which is fine. I like it. I kind of like the paths. That's neat. Citizen 3. All right, Yis Roel. What do you need for Citizen 3? No complaints yet about what you have or don't have? I guess we'll find out in a bit. So what's a barracks do, by the way? That requires research. Okay. There's a barracks tower. Yeah, we'll see. All right, everybody to sleep. Um, I'll come back in a minute once I know what we need for house th three. Well, guys, we need a lot of things. We need a lot of things. Boy, oh boy, do we need a lot of things. Blue and black carpet, bookshelves, chiseled stone, clay, oak shingles, Heavy weighted pressure plates, lots of oak logs and planks, another red bed, a uh, carpet, stone button, stone pressure plate. I'll take care of all this stuff in a bit. It's the dyed stones or wool that's really going to get me, and probably the bookshelves too, but eh, we'll see. We'll see. Ugh. I'm going to go do the things that I do. All right, so what I'm doing now, by the way, guys, is I'm putting most of the resources I need in the storehouse for these folks because my suspicion is um, that, for example, if, if this guy's got, let's say, you know, a bunch of carpet and all that stuff, right? 
Um, he's not going to share with his other builder buddy. Uh, that's what I think will happen. Now, what are you missing? Let's put, it, let's put exactly what you need in here, right? So that, and then X's will go in here. So that way my courier will bring all the excess items that he needs to the other hut, and that should be cool. That's kind of how I'm playing this right now. So you're probably needing a bunch of things too, but a lot of that should be available over there. Now, what about cobblestone stairs? That's my question. And spruce fence. I should teach you how to make spruce fences. I should, shouldn't I? Uh, teach recipe spruce. I should teach you spruce stairs. <clears throat> I should teach you spruce fences. I should teach you spruce slabs and spruce planks. And what I should consider is having you also handle spruce. All right, good. So maybe what I'll do is get some spruce slap saplings. And what I'll do, let's just, uh, yeah, one more spruce. And then you can go back to normal saplings for the rest. That should be cool. And are you good enough, happy eh? and everything? Like, you, you good? Because I noticed there's, um, how do I phrase this? There's, there's work to be done and you're not doing it. What up, Brooke? Don't just stare at me. Work to be done and not doing it. I get to build it again? You do. You do get to build it again. Isn't that exciting? Do you need something? Like, is there something you don't have? Not good enough, eh? I mean, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that at all. I'm just saying, what are you doing? Yeah? Yeah? Go on. You can do things. Oh, look! All of a sudden working. Very nice. There you go. Good job. So now, knows how to do all the spruce things. Let's make sure that there's just a, a surplus of spruce wood in the warehouse for them. Just to kind of start so we don't have to wait for the spruce trees to build up. And that should be fine. And I'm going to put away this guard tower for now because I don't think we need another one of those just yet. But now the sawmill should make the spruce components that you need, right buddy? Uh, and everything else should be making its way over here by way of courier. And I asked for some more clay shingles, so we'll go put them. And courier will take care of the job. Cool. I think. We got two couriers going on, so I gotta imagine they're gonna do stuff. Hey look, they are kind of following the path. Look at that. Neat. And then he's like, eh, whatever. I'm gonna go get some lunch. I hope. I know, you don't have work towers and stuff. So, not happy with the number of guards and homelessness. Is he homeless? That can't be true. Can't be true. Eh, we'll figure it out. Come back in a few. Oh, hey guys, check this out. Um, I was just reading yesterday's video comments, and somebody mentioned that if I built a guard tower, it would expand my borders. And that absolutely is true. So, guard towers expand your borders. Today I learned... Remember, like, we, you know, we built this building right on the edge of our borders. So by building a guard tower here, we now expanded the border this much. That's kind of, I had no idea that was the case. See, there's a lot to this mod that is just nuanced, and, and there's so much to know. It's awesome, though. It's awesome. Where is Melina? She complained for weeks that she didn't have a job. I gave her a job. I've yet to see her working. Melina, what's up? You know, I mean, Brooke, doing a great job. Loving it. Builders, awesome. You guys are killing it, as always, right? Very, very pleased. Red carpets are needed. Courier is probably going to bring you guys red carpets, I would imagine. If they could stop getting, you know, sidetracked over here. I like their pathing. They're like, we follow the path. We follow the path. We have to go to that building. Let's turn left and then go around this way. And then we can get to the building. That's okay. I'm assuming you're bringing carpet, right, buddy? I really hope so, because that's the only thing we needed. Yes, good job. Cool. Courier's doing a good job. Look at that. And you? Are you pleased? You could use a few more things, but we'll get there. Cobblestone stairs might be a thing. I'm just going to throw a bunch of those 
into ye old warehouse, right? It's it's kind of fun managing the village. Um, I'm debating like what I want more of at this point. You know what I mean? I'm like, obviously, I think I need to upgrade the houses even further, uh, which we will obviously be getting to. I think so. Like you're both working on Citizen Three, right? We're gonna obviously need a lot more clay shingles. Can you do that many for me? That would be lovely. Um, beautiful. Well done. And then we can probably queue this guy to be upgraded. And this guy to be upgraded. So once these two houses are done being upgraded, the next two should start. And that should be cool. All right, Kai's got everything he needs for the house. Uh, Yeast Roel has mm, some things. Waiting on a few others. I'm assuming our couriers will be taking care of that. Do you have an inventory over here yet? Not really. I mean, if I need to do something, I'll do it. What are you guys carrying around, by the way? I I'm just curious what's in your inventory. Ah, cool. I'll take care of it. Sweet. All right, so he's dropping off, right. I'm assuming Eric's doing the same. Thank you. I, I like how Eric had one bookshelf in his... Okay, cool. Yeah, and then Oak Log is cool. And then a few more shingles and we should be good. I know we have the shingles in here, so uh, they will deliver them and we'll be good. Let me just get the bulk shingles that I made. Because I know we're going to need lots of shingles for the other two houses, too. There. Now they have all the things. Beautiful. So you guys should be... Oh, look at that. Those houses are looking good. You know what else I should do? I should upgrade the builder here to level 4. That's totally a thing I should do. Totally a thing I should do. But hey, that's looking good. So I'm not 100% sure, but this looks like, you know, the house being almost done. Is the house almost done? What's Kai placing now? Is he placing torches? I have no idea what he's doing. Man, this place got fancy real quick, huh? Is there a second story now? Or is there about to be a second story now? It's your gold. That would be cool. I mean, it definitely looks like there's going to be a second story. Oh, yeah, look at that. Neat. There's totally an upstairs bedroom. Yeah, look at that. Cool. How many people can live in a tier three house? That's actually a good question. Let me look at that. So the number of citizens that can live in a house is equal to the building level. So even though there's four beds in there, like that was why I questioned it. See, one, two three four uh but a level three house can house three citizens and a level four house can do four citizens level five house can do five citizens cool all right kai you're doing such a good job what's left to be built over there just a few red carpets and some torches sweet so it looks like we're about to finish our level three house here and that one's well on its way too which is awesome and we should have most of the resources we need um to get the other two upgraded as well but we'll find out uh probably next episode because i'm gonna i'm gonna let these guys upgrade the other two houses and uh you know get them going but kai's about done here so this is a completed level three house which looks really quite nice hooray all right wrapping up point for the episode double 20 signing off hope you guys enjoyed it we will come back next episode and what i'll do is we'll have these two houses upgraded to level three as well and then i'll probably upgrade this guy to level four uh just have a level four builder's hut and we might even get level four houses we'll see but having a bunch of like high level houses see look as soon literally seconds after we finished the house they're like child's here okay i get it but maybe you guys could have let me hire somebody and customize what stats we get. I guess we'll find out. I mean, maybe I'm just maybe I'm just not keeping up with houses enough. In fairness, I'm not doing a great job of keeping up with houses. I'm almost wondering if I want another builder so we could do three buildings at once. That would be kind of cool. Um, and then I have not seen Melina show up at all to work. 
Like, not once. So, like, you actually work here, right, Melina? Like, that's a thing that happens? I have no idea. We'll find out. For now, don't wait signing off. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I should look into what the sawmill actually does. If I'm, if I'm wrong about what the sawmill does, I will let you know. All right, guys. Take it easy.